Polish manufacturers Akvady Mechanic and Tarno has tested its anti-drone system built on the Rada multifunction radar and the Browning Type 12.7mm WKLM machine gun. The information became available after the company published a video of the test, and Defense24 says that the test was performed at the Wiko Morski test site. It is clear from the distributed video that the targets of the Polish system were a civilian drone, as well as at least one drone in a fixed-wing configuration. The Rada radar writes Defense 24 has the ability not only to track larger aircraft objects, but also those of the Nano class or the so-called micro-objects. Depending on the size of the unmanned aerial vehicle, the RADA has a different range. If the drone is from a Nano class, the radar catches it up to 3 km, if it is a micro BA up to 5 km, and a mini class drone is detected at a distance of at least 10 km. 12.7mm machine gun WKLM is Browning type. It can make 3600 shots in one minute. The machine gun is connected to both radar and visual and thermal imaging cameras, a laser rangefinder that can automatically point the weapon system if the radar detects a drone 10 kilometers away. DEFENSE24 also writes that in addition to the aforementioned connected devices, the weapon system has an operator station. In this way, the entire weapon system can be controlled remotely. Another application of the anti-drone weapon system is that, according to some experts, it can easily be used as a short-range air defense system. Such weapon stations, such as the Polish ones, are often used for defense weapon systems, which aim to protect certain facilities, buildings, sites of strategic national importance, data centers, or other types of communication centers, etc. After installing a suitable carrier, the system can be a mobile safety umbrella for located units, field workshops, or makeshift airports. After adjusting the design, it is possible to use the system on small ships as an artillery system for direct defense SUS, close-in weapon system. Three modes of operation are programmed, fully manual, in which the operator directs the firing agent to the target using a manipulator, semi-automatic, in which the operator's actions are supported by automatic tracking of the object in the video path, an automatic mode in which the target can be captured automatically, and the operator decides to fire at the exact time specified by the system.